to me, what you're doing is getting the word out what you're doing. In other words, you're sending out announcements, you're sending out, um, and it can be in different forms of communication, maybe uh, going through some of your, whether it's the local media, the contacts, or let's say the shows and towns that you know, you're, you know, the galleries, different towns, making sure that those media outlets uh, know that you're going to be exhibiting uh, a lot of visual. I mean, here in the visual arts industry, all of you. So in this case, you want to make sure that they see uh, that, you know, sure that they see their, your work and, um, but let them know you're here. Let them know. Uh, they write about, you know, it's interesting whether they write or they talk about them, they are always looking for uh, artists. Um, yeah, I'm thinking of arts reporters, obviously, and uh, they want something new. They get tired. Yeah, they, I'm sure they'll write about the big, you know, museums and galleries are well known, but they also like the uh, new folks, too, and there are folks that are up and coming. So you get the word out, like I say, as much as you can, get those announcements out. Uh, press releases through what I call media alerts, letting them know uh, just in very brief, uh, factual, where you're going to be. Send photos. Always include photos, whether it's a press release, a media alert. You can send out a little email uh, if you know them. Uh, te uh, even text, you can certainly communicate. Um, uh, it, I'm sure many of you are on social media, but in any form that you can, get that uh, word out that way. Make sure that the reporters see you in those forms. So you can get them out the snippets and announcements and uh, the press releases. Uh, and the more that, you know, the consistency, and let's face it, the more that they see your name, in other words, they see that press release or they see that announcement or media alert, the more they're apt to take notice. 